have some exciting new features on the SEO2 Analog Boutique Synthesizer based on a lot of feature requests we got from customers and artists. This is a free update and it's available on our website, so check out RolandUS.com. So the first feature that we've added is manual control of the pulse width. And to do that, you can hit the comp and play buttons at the same time to get into the setup view when you're in patch mode. And then eight will be the pulse width depth. So I'm gonna play a, a tone right here and then raise that up. You can go all the way up to 127. We can start to hear it doing its thing. And then if I go to seven, this is the uh, LFO rate, which I can speed up all the way to 127 as well. The next feature that we've added is uh, two great new recording modes for the sequencer. The first one is a step-based recording mode, which will let you uh, automatically type in a melody and it will put it in each uh, sequencer step. So to get there, you just hold perform, hit note, and type in the melody that you want to experiment with. The second recording mode that we've added is real-time record. Now this is really cool because it actually gives you an internal metronome that you can adjust the level of, uh, which will help you record in real time. So it, to do that, hold perform, hit the start and stop button at the end. And you can see that it's recording now. And just use the value knob to increase the volume of that metronome and start playing. done, press perform again to keep your recording. Also included in the update are brand new sounds made by many of us here at Roland and Studio Electronics. Uh, they're all held in bank D and you can get there by pressing the bank A button twice. And it's blinking letting you know that you are now in bank D with the brand new sounds. So let's take a listen to some of them. In addition to these updates, Studio Electronics has developed a software editor for the SEO2. It's useful for storing different types of patches, renaming them, and is a great visual tool to look at your SEO2 and uh, edit it from a software perspective. You can also look at the synth. There's a visual representation of the SEO2 that you can edit. It's a really great way to make the computer interface with your SEO2. Be sure to check out Studio Electronics SEO2 editor, and for all of our firmware downloads, go to RolandUS.com.